Hey, how you doing? Welcome back to another exciting installment of TGTV. So with this one, I'm just going to show you how to add an effect into the chain. Now here we have an effect chain that, you know, I've not done much to it. I've not modded much of it. You can see that the, the four available blocks there have not been used yet. Okay, so all you need to do is when you blow one of these blocks, obviously this wheel selects that part of the block that you need. All you need to do is just turn this bottom dial And that selected the effect that you need, okay. Same thing if you move to the next one, got a distortion there. So you want to move along the chain a lot quicker. As you saw there, just press the button down and it shows you all the different types of effects that are here. And as you're starting to see with this top wheel, you just move your way along. Okay, so you got, just to give you an idea of what you've got here. Just a quick look at all the drive stuff that's there. So you've got all your base stuff as well, right? down to all kinds of fuzzies and stuff, and some of the line six, all the stuff that is modeled there as well. Dynamics, you've got compressors, and then you've got gates, more compressors, loads of choice there. You've got a dedicated EQ block with all kinds of EQ. I tend to like the 10 band, because it's, you know, just easy to get onto those dials and start messing about. And you've got your other ones there as well, but into the mods and we've got all the usual stuff based on loads of classic pedals there, of course. And here you'll find the delays. Again, I'm just doing the basics here. So just having a quick look through these, okay. And there you've got loads of options there as well. There's a lot of effect available in terms of how much you can dial in as well. So. Just start toward the lower side, unless you want, you know, daft crazy sounds going on. There's all kinds of weird stuff there in the pitch section. And you've got filters and stuff there as well. Obviously, you've got the wild pedal as a standalone thing within the chain, which you saw earlier. But yeah, that's all you do. Just hit the bottom dial. Just press that down. Work your way along. Hit the ones that you want. And obviously within there, you can actually just work your way along that particular style of effect. And if you keep going along, it just takes you down that coloured chain that you saw before. But yeah, I hope you found that helpful. Um, just hit subscribe at the bottom of the video if you like what I do. And uh, don't forget to check out, check out my tone shop. There'll be details there in the description below as well. But yeah, thank you for listening and uh, have a fantastic day. Bye bye.